showcasing the latest trends in telecommunications to the development of mobile banking. Apps World Africa attracted everyone from mobile operators to financial institutions. The mobile money world is where mobile phones are used to create a financial transaction. Whether you're purchasing goods or you're getting financial information, you're doing mobile banking. In Africa, where credit card usage is low but mobile penetration is high, many businesses are seeing great value in investing in this lucrative market opportunity. Mobile is that ubiquitous service across the world. With 500 million subscribers in Africa, it's an opportunity brands need to tap. With more than 52 million active SIM card users in South Africa alone, banks like FMB are competing for market share in the mobile banking sector. FMB is the leader with more than 2.8 million users. When there's mobile money and there's money that's being connected to phones, so you have wallets on phones, it gives businesses the opportunity to be able to build customers. The mobile commerce platform is where we now find major firms like Google making its mark with its announcement of the Google Wallet. At Google we've been focusing on three key points, which is all around access, relevancy and sustainability. Access is all about getting the consumer connected online in Africa, we're focusing on the mobile phone, so trying to bring in cheaper handsets with various handset manufacturers. What we're trying to do is drive awareness with business. Your consumers are already there. Um, you don't need to go find them, say, over a PC. They're all on their mobile phones. So being able to get the business community into shows like this and demonstrate A, what is the technology about, and B, how is that consumer already using the technology? And they're there in huge numbers. With a large number of Africans without access to banking facilities, applications like mobile wallet can help change the future of Africa's business landscape. These are just some of the issues under the spotlight at Apps World Africa 2011.